So I actually started filming this video about two months ago, but if I didn't include this last bit, it would have been incomplete. I lost connection to my avatar two times now, and I wanted to show you how the drone reacts and what you can do about it. We're gonna start with the happy case, and afterwards, um, the not so happy case. Okay, so, as I was flying down this cliff on the Lofoten Islands in Norway, you might have seen the video from that, I drifted a bit to the left uh, down this massive cliff and I realized way too late that this dive is gonna cut my connection. I mean, it was clear to begin with, but flying usually gives me sweaty hands, so I probably forgot anyway. Here you can see my position, the mountain and uh, the drone. So obviously there was no connection whatsoever. I'm not sure if it was me pressing the brake button or the drone realized itself, but for some reason, after some tumbling, it managed to stop right away and fly back to me. Well, that worked out pretty good. You know what didn't work out that good? The well, second time this happened to me. A few weeks ago, we were driving down this beautiful road in Hawaii. There was lots of curves and also lots of trees, which is kind of the first red flag. It's already been a quite long day, so I was quite tired of the drive, which is the second red flag, but nonetheless, I had the urge to fly my drone anyway. So we parked right on the side of the street and I went for it. I guess it worked out so, so. The shots I got were not really worth it since it was one of these, yeah, quick last minute ideas without much planning, which is kind of the third red flag. So after about two or three minutes of flying, I went along the street and wanted to turn around uh, on top of the mountain next to it. But then I kind of lost the signal. I mean, probably it was because of this hill, but it didn't feel that high. In this case, the avatar didn't nicely tumble and then break midair, but probably managed to dive headfirst into a tree or a few. We spent about an hour searching that evening. It got dark quite quickly, so we decided to uh, search for it the next morning, but we couldn't find it. I was able to let it beep once, but after that I think the battery flew out of it and I couldn't connect to it anymore. Within all of these nice green tones, uh, the, the shape of the avatar was not really distinguishable from anything else, so uh, yeah. It was kind of lost. But luckily I opted in for this DJI um, refresh package, so I was able to um, register it as a flyaway and... Um, um, so let's open this. Here we go. I will definitely consider one of these uh, straps that you can put around your battery, just in case, um, like me, um, the drone somehow crashes into something and the battery pops out. Now I have to do some more practicing before I fly again. And I hope this is gonna be my last avatar that I need. Uh, I don't wanna crash it and lose it again. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you don't lose your drone and always think twice before flying and stay safe. Bye.